Asadullah graduated from Kabul University in Afghanistan, but could not find a job and decided to leave his country. His journey took him to Serbia, where he spoke with VOA as he neared a refugee camp. I've been en route for 10 or 11 days, passing mountains, valleys and deserts. I am not sure if the camp will let us inside and register us. Asadullah, who did not want to provide his last name, isn't alone waiting outside this refugee reception and transit camp in Obrenovac on the outskirts of Serbian capital, Belgrade. Dozens of Afghan refugees enter Serbia daily, hoping to be registered and reach Western European countries. Shaukatullah, who only provided his first name, says before reaching Serbia, he was deported repeatedly back to Turkey from Bulgaria. I'm in Bulgaria. We were deported four times. Bulgaria arrested us. They made their dogs bite us. They beat us. Other than that, they take whatever you have. We faced many difficulties reaching Serbia. Now we are in Serbia, in a camp. The refugees here have taken treacherous routes to Europe, traveling through Iran, Turkey and Bulgaria to reach Serbia. Another Afghan refugee, Murtaza Ahmadi, says he suffered illness and injuries on his journey. But he is determined to reach his destination, Germany. I got sick on the way. My foot is injured. No one helps us. I do not know who is to blame, ourselves, the UN or Serbia. For decades, Serbia served as an avenue for migrants to reach Western Europe. However, it is now more challenging for refugees to go from Serbia to their preferred destinations. According to a UN Refugee Agency report, Afghans made up 36% of the nearly 130,000 refugee arrivals in Serbia in 2022. Syrian refugees were in second place with 29%. For Wali Aryan in Belgrade, Serbia, Bejan Hamdard, VOA News.